I'm Jeff Dolan and I'm in the Department of Sustainable Biomaterials. I'm interested in bioenergy and biomaterials. Uh, I'm from Salisbury, Maryland and for those out-of-state students I get in-state tuition because of the academic common market. My experience in the department, um, it's been great. Uh, since my sophomore year I've been doing undergraduate research. Um, if you go up to any of the professors they usually will have a research opportunity for you. Um, that research is, is great, not only for your resume, but it's just a totally other learning experience. Um, you get to control your experiments. You, you find in-depth information that you didn't know about before. Um, and you, you can either get paid, you can do credits. Um, so it's really an experience that uh, I found very helpful, um, especially interviews and things like that. They always want to know about your research. They want to see if it pertains to what um, that company does. What I've done in the past is uh, we've used cellulose, uh, which is a basic chemical component of, of a wood material, or you can use cotton. Um, it's the most abundant organic resource on the earth. And basically what you can do with that is a, a bunch of different things. Um, for instance, we've used uh, calcium and we've um, treated a piece of cellulose scaffold with the calcium and we made uh, synthetic bone tissue. So like if you were to break your bone and you needed bone repair, they could use this as a scaffold. So they, um, instead of using another part of your body, which they would usually do, they would just use this synthetic uh, bone scaffold in place of that. And it actually is very biocompatible with your own body. What are sustainable biomaterials? Uh, so we're using everything that is renewable. So we're using everything from the land to the sea, um, from the sea we have algae and kelp that we can turn into polymeric materials for drug delivery systems and then uh, you go on the land and we have our grasses and our bamboo and our wood and we can turn those into bioenergy and biomaterials and bioplastics. We're going to run out of petroleum at some point in time and the only thing left is you know to look towards these sustainable biomaterials. You know necessity drives innovation and uh, what we need to do is really embrace that and kind of get ahead of that. And what this department is doing is uh, we're looking towards the future. Virginia Tech is a great school. Um, the department is even better. It's individual attention, um, small class sizes, um, great teachers. They do whatever they can to, to meet whatever requirements or needs you have. A really compassionate group of people. Um, they love what they do and they express that in their teachings. Um, I don't think I've ever had a class here that I've not liked the material, I've not liked the teacher. They make you want to learn.